What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back to more Monster Hunter Stories 2. Let's go talk to the chief, find out what our next mission is. I haven't been. Welcome. Better story, the Angel Parts. I have the Anja, but I don't have the Toby. Uh, I mean, next biome, I can probably do this bad boy, which I love that thing so much. This is also looking good, but mm, Irish jaw blade. But damn, the damage on that 92. 85, 63. No, I might need to do that. I, there's not, I haven't seen another hammer as potent as that. I mean, I have, actually, as much as I killed Tigrix, I'm probably just gonna do both. Thank you. Those that don't know, we discovered that uh, royal monsters respawn every time you leave and return to a zone. And it took a lot of farming to get Tigrix to actually retreat so that I could follow him and get an egg. The windmill's close to completion from the looks of it. What else do you need? Someone pinch me. It's the legendary. Yeah! Ryder! Say what? Mm. Don't you mean legendary feline? Chief says you need parts for the windmill? Ah, uh, yes. Thing is, I'd need to go to the Jagged Rock Cave to get them, and it's not safe to go in. Why not? There's something in there that attacks people. Not a sound to warn you, and you're knocked out. It... it doesn't make a sound? Mm. It's true, I tell you. I'm not setting foot in that cave until someone sees to it that it's safe. <laughs> I'm not gonna pretend it doesn't sound a little scary, but if we band together, we've got nothing to fear. Good luck. The windmill parts from that cave are the last pieces I need. The windmills really are impressive. Aren't they? They symbolize the strength of the bonds between us. They... they do? Ask anyone and they'll say the same. Without Avinia, there'd be no windmills here now. Huh? Come on, let's go to that cave. Yeah! Good idea! I'm just trying to think what it could be. Unseen foe, the last part seen to complete Jaya Rock Cave. Attacked by an unknown assailant, sowing fear among villagers. I'm trying to think. Unknown assailant that attacks people in a cave. I mean, assuming... It would have to be like a stealthier monster, but we already fought Narcilla, so it's not her. That guy said you're the one who made the windmills happen. Is that true, Avinia? To tell the truth, he was terrified of Frostfang at first. So, you mean he was against you coming back? That's right. But he seems perfectly fine around Frostfang now. Getting him and other villagers to accept Frostfang was a painfully long process. When I returned with Frostfang by my side, I was hopeful. At the time, the village was in really bad shape. There was even a monster living there. It seemed
seemed like a lost cause. What are we gonna do about that monster? Frostfang, let's go! Hey, it's Avinia! Did you come back to help us? Why else? Frostfang and I came back to do our part. I'm sorry about what I said to you. Stay in Kuan, please. Frostfang can stay too, of course. Okay, I'll stay. Let's rebuild our village together. They accepted Frostfang into the community, so we stayed. The windmills were the first things we rebuilt together. They mean so much to Kuan. They've come to symbolize all of us coming together, Frostfang included. Aw, I love a happy ending. And Frostfang became part of the Kuan family. Now, if we could only get people to trust Ratha, too. I know how you feel about Ratha. He's as special to you as Frostfang is to me. You want him to be accepted? Keep trying. And eventually, people will come around. Yeah! And remember, you can count on me all the way! The monster in the cave is a Kezu. I'm sure of it. A long time ago, I got attacked by one and it knocked me out cold. This won't be easy. Kezu? That's such a weird choice for a stealth- I mean, it's an unknown assailant, it attacks people and knocks them out. Like, Kezus are literally- they're blind. Like, isn't it blind and deaf? It's like- it's like you're being assassinated by Helen Keller, the monster. Like, that should not happen. piece of me. I just noticed I can just tap X to switch monster and Y to switch weapons. That is so... I'm gonna be just doing that way more. Rock break monster because Azeros is the garbage. I mean, to be fair, for the most part, I'm getting by with like three monsters. 10,000, let's go. Like, roughly the cost of the weapons now, so. Tell me I just picked up like weakness exploit. Increases crit rate somewhat when hitting a monster part with an advantageous weapon. That sounds really good. Um, I'm gonna keep this on for now. Just because having both part breaker and cold res are super, super useful for this area. 
I mean, part breaker in general is good, but having cold res on, obviously nice quality of life here. It's going up enough to see the map. Oh, no, it does go all the way up. Where are you at? I need to get this chest. I'll despawn. right, but I'll be turning left. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm liking dash monsters more than uh, Narga Kuga. I mean, Narga and Stealth was nice, but ah, being able to just sprint around real fast. a kezu that's still baffling to me like the fact that it's it's maybe a kezu that we're about to fight of all the things here you know i mean this environment makes sense for kezu but Deadly assassin I've ever seen. I'm gonna guess the Kezu would be a technical monster, so let's just stick power. Yep. I remember, I think they're weak to fire as well. Are Kezu's weak to fire? Let's see. Kezu, weakness. Weakness to fire. Uh, switch monsters. Anjanath, come on out. Hot mist. Gonna guess it goes to speed. Look 
looking for a double technical in a second. A double, uh, double kinship. It's gonna try and do it again. Um, okay, hang on. It's gonna be something I could use here. Doesn't matter, it's already blind. Oh no. Figure and I put it to sleep for a turn. Damn, dude. This Kazu is a mean motherfucker. Why can I not ride? Is it because I'm am I paralyzed? What's the problem? No, I can fight. Oh shit, my meter's not full. Son of a bitch. I just did electric. It was technical. It's probably. Going back to technical. Assault. I haven't shown this one on video yet. We did this on stream, but it's crazy. It would show up whether or not blunt damage works. I guess I could maybe see it if, like, you know, you don't see the kezu and it screeches and the screech paralyzes you. But still, I mean, getting getting killed by kezus is kind of embarrassing. Which I'm surprised how high they rated this, because this means the kezu is a higher... Buddy, you've gotten stronger. It's all thanks to your bonds with different monsters. Yeah, this... this Based on where we fought the Kezu, it would be rated as high as, uh, you know, an Anjanath or uh, Zamitros. Keep it up, and you'll be a positively claudacious writer, just like the one who inspired Avinia. Who said that boy was a writer? Hmm? So, he isn't a writer? He tried his hardest to become a writer, but... It just never worked out for him. 
If anyone should know that, it's you, Naviru. How? I think you're being a bit unfair. I never even met the guy. You've really forgotten him? Wait, so it's someone I know, like, personally? He never earned the title of rider, but he did ride the great Poogie. Though, the Poogie wasn't very pleased. No, no way! You mean to tell me it's... Day Day. Debly? Debly? Okay, let's get going. <laughs> what is this face? my friends. I see you've dealt with the Kezu. Of course, I expected no less from legendary heroes. Chief, this actually isn't the legendary ride. <laughs> Chief, you set the bar pretty high for us, huh? Thanks to your sweat and hard work, we'll have all the windmills working again. That's one thing off the to-do list. One thing? To-do list? Sounds like there's more. Yes, I've been too tied up here to look into the pit. I'd love to have your help, my friends. All right, let's get to the pit. Please, be careful out there. I'm not sure why, but the monsters near that pit have been acting up. You're telling me the Zamtrios we met outside the village was not what I would call friendly. I see. It seems to be happening all around. The guild's calling the lights Rage Rays. Rage Rays? The strange light from the pits is what's enraging monsters. At least, that's the guild's theory. Light that makes monsters mad. You may run into some Rage Raid monsters by the pit. Keep an eye out. Don't worry about us, Chief. Let the legendary duo handle this. Thank you. Good luck, my friends. We've been searching far and wide, but still no trace of old Day Day. The felines and I will keep up the search. Pit probe. I wonder what the final monster is for this zone. So when we saw Gamoth as a royal. I feel like it would be some other, like, snow-heavy monster. Welcome. That looks creepy. That's a razor. Bag of horrors. Jesus. armor self heal medium wow that's actually pretty nice sounding that might be uh might be worth an upgrade though crit heal and partner also sound dope Thank <laughs> you. 
hate that I'm getting a bunch of levels to monsters that don't want. I need a new rock breaker monster. I guess, no, hang on. What happened to Basarios? I would take Basarios over Azeros. Screw Azeros. He's garbage. That's right. I had to sacrifice Basarios. I forgot. I think. Did I sacrifice him? Do I have eggs? Well, I have a couple eggs. So, okay. Um... Nargo's getting sacrificed at one point. And I, I must have, yeah, I think I used up my Rocky Boy for- No, he's right there! Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Expe oh, you're part of the expedition team, that's why. You out. Uh, sure, do that. No, you don't have Rock Breaker. You have Ground Dive. Damn it. Who has Rock Breaker? Swim and Monster Search. Well, shit. little guy eat up actually I really I would like to to do burning blast um, what we got on you critical kinship gene critical kinship small and medium critical hits filled the gauge faster it's not bad ice gene medium and then warming the gates frostbite Using Gene Medium Ice Spear. I think my Zami already has upgraded Ice Spear. Yeah, he does. He has Freezing Gene. Peaks is probably where I want to go for this next mission. Yep, exactly right. Uh, which, by the way, since we did it all on stream, for those that are curious, you can find yourself as an ogre right up here. I found this just exploring the mountain. There he is. But anyway, uh, we're going to wrap up. We're heading to the lava in the pit in the next part, so stay tuned. And I will see you all then with more. <laughs>